hope you are enjoying it. Mm-mm. <laughs> so nice. It's a long time mm. you, you, you eat this kind of thing. What the book was? What the book? The book. 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 I am not happy that you just came back from from Germany after seven years like this, like this. Mama is well. It is well. You know, um, when I first got to Germany, I got a job, a very good job. I've been working there for a while. Till so one fateful day. The MD of the company invited me to his office. Hmm. When I came to see him, he told me that they don't need my services anymore in the company. Like that? Just like that. Hi. For no just reason. I asked him severally, what is my offenses? No. He said nothing, that he doesn't want me in the company anymore. I have to check out from the workers' quarters for the company, I have to check out from there. I was roaming around the streets of Germany. Oh. No shelter, nothing. I was just homeless. One day I was just walking on the streets. The police saw me and they arrested me. Before I know it, I'm in the streets of Lagos, down to Nigeria. Oh. Huh? Oh. I thank God. Hmm? I thank God that you are here alive. Oh, come on. And now, thank God you came back alive. Honestly, when I got the news, I was so disappointed that you stayed all these years in Germany and came back empty handed. But my brother is okay. I believe in God. You are going to, you are, you are going to make it. You will bounce back again. Yes. Okay? <laughs> Everything is going to be okay. Hmm? It's okay. I don't want to see tears in your eyes. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see tears. God knows what to do in this situation. Hmm? It's okay. It's okay. okay. Don't Namu. cry. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Hmm? Everything is going to be okay. It's okay. Hmm? Namu. Hey, Namu. Now that you are home, what is the next plan? What do you plan to do? No, don't even shed tears. Though. Don't shed tears at all. Hmm? God is there. He's on the throne. So what is the, your next line of action? Um, when I arrived in Nigeria, I called this my friend that stays in the city, mm -hmm. Godric. Mm -hmm. So he told me that I should come to the city mm -hmm. instead of staying in the village. Let's, let's look for the next plan, the next opportunity for me. So I plan living first into more money. More like it. Uh, more like it because... Eh? I wouldn't want anybody to know that you are home. Yeah. You know our people now, they will start mm -hmm. wagging their tongues. I don't want anybody to know. Hmm? Tomorrow morning, very, very early, I'll yeah. bring things together and then off you go. Hmm? Morning boss. Morning yeah. boss. Morning boss. It's okay. Hmm? So mm. Thank Sorry. you. Mm -hmm. uh, Mama, how is Mama again? Oh, my maker, eh? mm. she's fine. Okay. Uh, she's fine, but I wouldn't want her to know. Yeah. Uh, I wouldn't that want anybody to know. Mm. Okay. okay. Eat off, eat off. So well <laughs> Oga, wait. What are you giving me? Two hundred naira. Oga, I'm only now one thousand. So you can't give me from where? See, no, no, let me pay. So I can't give from that junction. You tell me, you tell me, give me, give me two hundred naira. I take this one, I beg. From this junction to this place, what am I giving five hundred naira? Now, why not? Oga, wait. Now, take this one, man. What's happening? Now, give me money. So I'm taking that for you. If you don't give me money, what's the worry? So this guy, you. Eh. Don't say they're embarrassing. You're embarrassing me too. Don't say they're serious. Serious. Everybody look. Don't say they're embarrassing me too. Why would why would you give me this money? Leave my shirt. I'm not going to take it. 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 I'm not
What is going on? 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 Okay, just calm down. How much? He's He's giving me 200. Don't worry. Just let me continue. Don't worry. I'll pay him, okay? I'll pay him. See, you get out of the house. Sassy, then, boss. Yeah, but I see me too. Sassy, 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 Sassy. Who man up? I know them on your soup and boy. Okay, take, take, take. See you. Sorry, no vex, yeah? No vex. Thank you. You get out. It's fine. You get out. Nice, nice. Yellow, Papa. Is, is, is this your final destination? Yeah, this is my final destination. Okay. Huh? Uh, the guy I was, I, 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 I caught said that I, if, I, if I get here, I should, I should stop. Okay, it's okay, all right? Sorry. That's how most of them do. embarrassment. Okay. Sorry about it. That's how most of them do. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate it, okay? Right. It's fine. I really appreciate it. Let me, let me look for my way. You're embarrassing me on the road. I don't even know anybody here, sir. I don't even know my way to. to Yes, I'm here. I'm, I'm stranded. I don't know where to go to. Oh, what about the person we're supposed to talk to? His number is not connected. I've tried several. He's not going through. So, what, what did you check in? I don't know. I'm, I'm so stranded. I don't even know anywhere here. Uh, so, um, why don't you, I don't know if, if you don't mind, you can come over to my place. Depending when he takes your call or when his number connects. Depending when he takes your call. It's time we got to that. No, you, okay. listen, listen. Not, not that. I'm not asking you to come live with me. I mean, you can't keep standing on the road. It's been over two hours and you're still here. So I suggest you come over to my house, sit, chill, shower, relax, and wait for him. Whenever he calls or whenever his number connects, you can. Anytime, I, I, I'll drop you off. Are you sure about that? Why not? I, I don't bite. <laughs> I'm a harmless lady. I should be scared of you. It's all right. Thank you very much. All right, just put your stuff. Okay, just, yes, put it there. Are you sure about this? Very well. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> it's Shower while I get you something to eat. That's so nice of you. It's okay. I appreciate it. 
Come with me. So after you then. Sure. Thank you. It's okay. I am begging you. I am begging you, my Father and my God. Do not look at my sins. So. Do not look at the sins of my, my, my son. Help us. Direct my son. So that he will see his friends. And so that things will turn around for the better for him. Now. How are you? I'm fine. Mama, have you called Michael to know if he has gotten to Lagos? Is that just all you have to say? Immediately no, you come in here. Have you no. called Michael? Have you called him? No. Have you called him yourself? Mama, although, yeah, although he's, he's in Lagos now, but he told me that he has been calling um, Godric, but his number is, has not been going. Mm. Uh, that was what he told me too. He said that he has entered Lagos, but he has not seen his friend, mm -hmm. and the number is not going. But I know that my Redeemer liveth. Mm -hmm. I know that my Redeemer liveth, mm -hmm. that he will see his friend, and when he sees his friend, that things are going to be better for him, in Jesus' name. Mm -hmm. I know that. Mm -hmm. I know. Mm -hmm. Mama, see, do you know that rumor has started spreading in the village already? Rumor. That Michael, your son, came back from abroad empty handed. Eh? Who said that? Huh? Oh, you grew that thing? Oh, I said, but we could tell no one in our village. No one called me the other day and was telling me on the phone. Ah, ah. God. God, I'm going to go to the village. I'm going to go to the village. Do not allow my son to come back to this village so that he will not. These people that are saying one thing or the other will be put to shame. Amen. Because things are going to be better for him. Mm, Mama, I don't want I don't want this look <laughs> on your face. And I don't want it. And you want to start crying now. It's okay. It's okay. I know that this time around, Michael, your son, will come back with goodies. He will make it this time. I know. You don't trust you don't trust in God again. I trust in God. Huh? I trust I believe you. that this time you will make it. Let's go. Let's go inside. <laughs> you and walk every time, every time, eh? In this quad, you can want ya. Because we want, eh? Don't cry now. <laughs> hey, how are you? Doing? Uh, are you? I'm okay. <laughs> um, no problem. I'm fine. Actually, uh, you know my friend I told you about? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I do. What's wrong? I've been calling him. His number is not connected. Oh. So I think it would be wise for me to go back to the village. Go back to the village? No. No, Mike, you shouldn't. That is not a good idea at all. You are a young, vibrant, and promising young man has a lot to achieve in life. You need to improve in life. And going back to the village will just set you back. Please don't. Maybe that's what the future holds for me. No, don't say that. The future holds something better. Come on. You see, Mike, the past weeks you've spent in this house, I mean, the past weeks we've been together, I have come to realize that you're a really nice person. Yes, you're really nice and I can't just watch you go back to the village and waste. I promise to set you up. Yes, let me just open a business for you. Something to, to keep you busy instead of going back to the village. Mm 
Liest uns gut. You're a nice person too. Thank you. And I mean, I really appreciate for all you're about to do for me. It's okay. Thank you. So you're not going. No more village for me. Please, you're not even a village boy. You're <laughs> too cute to be a village boy. Uh, you see that face you were wearing when you walked in? That's... I don't like it. My beautiful boo. I hope you like the environment. Yes, this place is so beautiful. I like it. Just enjoy yourself. Drink and feel free. There is plenty of money to spend. So this is where you always come to enjoy yourself. Yes, babe. And there is one more place I'm going to take it. Which is? Have you been to our factory? Our Yes, babe. I do hear of Akwa Pro, but I'm not really been there. Really? I'm going to take you there tonight. Really? Oh my god! god. <laughs> I'll be so glad. Yeah, really. Come on, let's. Weta! Please get us. What would you do? You can't eat anything. Chicken is fine. Please, Weta, get us some chicken, please. Alright. <laughs> What if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead and will you get bored again? So if I play dead, will you regret everything that you did that you said? I don't think you understand what you're doing, and my heart's black and blue from the bruising. I feel like when I'm with you, I'm losing. I feel like you think that this amusing, sitting there gaslighting and confusing. Was it me? Is it me? Am I deluded? I'm the one who's always sorry, the conclusion Even though I offer all of the solutions I wish you loved me like I love you, it's stupid When I'm alone with you, I never feel lucid I wish I wasn't struck by Cupid I wish when I first saw you, I knew this When I'm with you, I feel so useless I feel diluted, my heart's been wounded Silhouettes of you are like a dawn Never really know just what you want with you, I don't ever feel calm I can feel the sweat inside my palm Play with me like cats and a string You don't understand the pain it brings You don't ever wanna give me wings You don't ever wanna set me free But if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead Baby, you'll get sick of being a monster Out of my head, under my bed Think you're something more money. What happened to the one million that I gave to you last month to support your business? One million? Yes! Are you thinking the money will still remain? Oh my god. You're joking. Don't tell me you did not invest that money in your business. Alfred, what do you want from me? What is wrong with you? What else do you want from me? You keep collecting money from me, always. Yet you can't even invest it. Aside from womanizing, aside from clubbing, aside from living recklessly, what else do you do for a living? Are you giving me the money or not, sister? I am not giving you a dime. And that is because I do not pluck money from trees. What? No problem. I know you will not give me the money. Because I want to. Meanwhile, who was that guy I saw when I walked in? Huh? How is that your business? Wow, I see. 
So you now accommodate men in your house. No problem. I will surely make it one day. Amen. Oh. If you make it, I'll be the happiest person on earth. Alfred, go and make your money. Go and make it. What is it? You're not forbidden from making your own money. Just imagine, imagine an old man, a grown man like this, asking me for money always. Can't you work and make money? If you need money, work and make your money work. What? Rubbish. You're collecting money from me. Today, one million. Tomorrow, 300,000. Next, tomorrow, 1.5 million. What are you doing with the money? You think I'm plugging money? You think I just go out and, and pick money from the streets? Go out and pick the money too. This is so easy. Nonsense. Asking me, who is that man? Are you not supposed to be hammering a woman in your own house? Nonsense. Why is your face like this? Hmm. Where is her what? Wait up. Don't tell me that you brought in a man to live with you. Uh huh. Yeah, I did. Who is he? <coughs> I met him a few weeks ago and decided to help him. Mm. Mm. So, when is he leaving? Leaving? Uh huh. Uh -uh. So soon. He's not leaving, he's not going anywhere. Not anytime soon, never. He's, <laughs> He's not leaving. Why? He's staying because I want to help him. Because I, 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 I feel like helping him is a good person. And he does not even have anywhere to go to. Hey, hey. What if he's a criminal? Uh, yes. A wanted person. I'm a robber. Eh? Come on, Melissa. He's not. He's a good person. I've stayed with him for a few weeks and I can tell he's nothing of any of these things you just mentioned. He's How not sure are you? He's not. I'm sure. Come on. Uh -uh. He's not. He's not. He's a good person. Yes. You need deliverance. <laughs> Rest. <laughs> you are laughing, right? <laughs> No problem. <coughs> Continue laughing. My dear, nothing is happening. Let me offer you something. Which though. offer? Let me get this Thank you so much, Olivia. My brother told me I established a business for him. And he's doing fine now. <laughs> oh, thank God. That's really nothing. <laughs> You see, sister, I truly love your brother, Mike. I love him so much that I can do anything and everything to make sure he's happy. Yeah, you're such a kind-hearted woman. <laughs> My God, we continue to bless you. Amen. You will, you will never lack anything in this life. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much. Uh, do you care for anything? What should I? We have food. Don't worry. Only this news that my brother told me, I'm okay. Oh. I'll tell him to be a good man to you. Ah, sister is already a good man. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let me already tell him you're around. Uh, it should be done bathing. Okay? Or I went for him. No problem. I went for him. No problem. She's nice. She's such a nice woman. Good. So there are still good women in this Listen to me. Don't break this woman's heart. She truly loves you. And no one can do this thing without your love. Please, my brother. Did you hear me? I've heard everything you said, sister. I'm not a good digger. I mean, I'm not an ungrateful person. So I really appreciate everything she's doing for me. I really, really appreciate So you have been the one eating my sister's money, all this one. My sister has been feeding you, giving you money, taking care of you. And you are looking like a man, look at how I am. No good clothes. All the money my sister is supposed to give to me, she has been giving it to you. Stay away from my sister, I don't want to warn you again. If I stay you close to my sister again, I will kill you. Listen, I know men like you. I know what you want. You are a gold digger. You want to eat my sister's money and run away, right? 
If I see you close to my sister again, I will kill you. I don't want to see you close to my sister again. Pardon me, who, who are you, please? Who are you, madam? Tell me, stay away from my sister. I don't want to see you close to my sister. If I see you close to my sister again, I will kill you. Don't fight him. I have told you. I don't want to see you close to my sister again. Foolish man. I will not throw you again. Don't fight him, sir. He called me good. It's okay. It's okay. Who is this? Are you serious? You mean my brother said those words to you? He said that to you? You know, where's my phone? Let me go and call him. No, 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 babe, stop. Don't do this. I don't want to go. I need to speak some senses into his call. Don't call me. He disrespected you. Baby, it's okay. Alright? I'm truly sorry. It's okay. I really can I ask you a question? I hope there's no problem. Please. Can you be the mother of my unborn children? Bro! <laughs> 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 Godric! Bro! Oh my god! Mike! I mean, if someone should tell me that I will ever see in this life again, I will not believe it. Man, it's a small world, man. It's a small world. Are you kidding me? <laughs> bro, check out the transformation. Yes, it's so, too much, man. Bro, life the has transformation been, is too alarming, bro. Life What's has been now? so good. Hold on, are you telling me that you own the company I saw you at? I'm the CEO. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Serious? Yes. <laughs> you know, a lot has been happening. Okay. I came to town to visit you, remember? Yes, I know. I called you several, your number was not connected. Even the cabman that I entered his cab was trying to embarrass me. Serious? Lo and thou, a beautiful damsel just came to my rescue. She's a multi-millionaire. Are you serious? This lady picked me up. She cleaned me up to become who I am today. Bro, Man. life has been so good. You don't need to say it, bro. <laughs> I see that already. <laughs> Man, I have to apologize <laughs> for not being able to take your, your call or get to me and stuff like that. It's not my fault, okay? Thank After, you for disappointing me. Uh, now I see. <laughs> it's a blessing in return, right? It's a blessing. It's a blessing. You know, after I spoke to you, Daddy, I lost my phone. I serious? lost my contact, I lost so many things. It took me days before I was able to recover my life. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry, bro. I'm so sorry, bro. But I'm then. I'm sorry, so sorry, sorry. Yes, of course. I have to tell you sorry for not taking your call, but it's a blessing. It's a time. blessing, bro. It's I a blessing. That already, bro. Oh, man. Look at me. You know, I travel to overseas, go for holidays, you know. The touring around. Hold on. Are you, are you saying that such ladies still do exist on this planet? They exist. Are you serious? <laughs> Godric! My goodness. Man, it's happy to see you. My goodness. I'm happy to see you. Happy to see wow. you. Wow! It's a small world. Very small, bro. Small world. <laughs> One of these days, I will invite yeah, you over to the house. Eh? I really can't wait so to see So you'll see this. my damsel. Of course. I can't wait to see this damsel house. <laughs> Turn to you around, you know. An angel. Don't this beautiful Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. I have houses, cars, you know. <laughs> Come on, Jacob. Waiter, get one more bottle, please. And uh, the bill is on me. Are you serious? It's on me. <laughs> Are you serious, bro? I will put to the task. Come on, drink, drink, drink. Drink, drink. drink up, bro. Drink up. Wow. Fine. 
Yeah. So what was that you were saying on the phone? Ah. Oh. Hey baby, why don't you go to the room so I can talk with um Auntie Melissa? Okay. Okay. Mm, I love you. Love you too. I'll see you later. <laughs> Yeah, so all they see. Yeah. Honey, you see that your husband there? Hey! Uh -uh. What's the meaning of. You, you, you see that's your husband there? What happened to my husband? It's fine. Your husband is cheating. <laughs> Are you okay? Are you normal? <laughs> What's a fun tree? How dare you walk into my house? I mean, you left everything you were supposed to do. You left your house, your work, and you come into my house to tell me that my husband, my girl that I have known for, for over how many years is cheating on me? What are you even talking about? Well, I'm not surprised. I know you will not believe me. Oh, shut up! Of course I won't believe you because it's not true. Olivia, I saw your husband with a lady and... I said shut up! Shut up! What? <gasps> you know my daughter is home. I'm going to be rude. What kind of, what kind of, what kind of lie? What kind of rubbish is this? What even gave you the guts to talk about my husband in such manner? Melissa, are you this? Are you like this? Why are you, why, why are you acting so desperately? Why would you even say my husband is cheating? Do you have an hidden agenda? Listen, I have known my girl for, for, for six, seven, eight years now. And the much I know about him is that the man I'm married to can never ever cheat on me. Listen, my girl is a loving, devoted, strict, intelligent, and a straightforward man. A good husband and a father. I know you're eager to say things. I know you're, you're eager to, I don't know, whatever it is you're up to. But don't come into my house to try to ruin my home. Okay, let's just imagine truly you saw him with a lady. What makes you think he's having something to do with a woman? So because he's married to me, he cannot, he cannot hang out. Not just hanging out, he cannot walk on the street with someone. Come on. At least expect this from you, please. What? I've told you to stop taking this small, small, small gogoro you used to take. It's affecting you. These are the side effects. Come to somebody's house and tell you, do you know your husband? I say, oh, I'm with a lady. No! Now, man, he go follow. You will see him with a man. Always. He should be with a man because he's married. Ha uh ha. -uh. Stop acting like an insecure lady. Oh. Is that the reason you're here? Say something. Now, let's just. Um, Olivia. Hmm. I'm so happy to meet you. So, so happy. <clears throat> Again, I must say thank you so very much for what you've done for my friend. I really do appreciate. Thank you mm -hmm. so much. Uh, you're welcome. It's really nothing. You see, <clears throat> like they say, love conquers all. And when a woman loves a man, she can do anything. I mean, anything for that man. I see. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I really want to say thank you for all you've been doing for me. It's nothing. I really appreciate. <laughs> <laughs> oh. someone, is, someone is jealous. Oh. <laughs> you can be serious. You know, <coughs> um, I would like to see Mabel before I leave. Yes. Oh, Mabel, she has gone to school. She's not around at the moment. But never mind. You'll see her over the weekend. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for coming. You're so welcome. Again, yeah, I also say thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Bro, we're bro. That's nice, man. Don't worry, I'm so happy. You get the nice moment. Some day. Some day. Some day. Some day. It feels like. Sir, of course. Your phone is ringing. How is that? I don't know, sir. No name was written on the screen. <laughs> Madam, do you need more fruits? Come on, get out of here. Oh, sorry, Wait. sir. 
Baby. Ah, uh -uh, baby. She just asked the question, and I think nothing is wrong with that. Did you tell her you need more fruits? Did you? Huh? huh? Uh. Too much privilege in this house is getting out of hand. She's taking it to another level. Sweetie, just give me a minute and I'm back, okay? Okay. I'll be right back. Are you an imbecile? Eh? No, How many times? How many times have I warned you never to bring my phone to me whenever it's ringing? Most especially when I'm with my wife. <laughs> so eh? that time, sir. I'm, I'm sorry, sir. Your phone has, has been ringing for over three hours now. I don't know what to do that to bring it to I you. Please shut up. If this repeats itself again, I'll get you fired. I'll get you fired. Small witch. Idiot. Mama. I want to pin your hair because I want you to hear from her directly everything she told me. Melissa, please tell them what you told me. Mama, I saw Michael, your, your son, with a lady and a little girl some days ago. You saw yeah. Michael? Where did you see him? And what was he doing when you saw him? I saw them coming out from a supermarket. They walked down to the car. Michael opened the door, the door, the car door for the lady to enter. So they they now zoom off. So what do you mean by that? Please, please, please. I don't believe what you are saying. Mama, that's the same thing I said. Because I do. I don't believe her at all. But even now, till this minute, I don't think she's saying the truth. Olivia, my love, my brother cannot cheat on you. Please don't listen to her. Uh, Melissa. Melissa. Mama. Please. Please, I am begging you in the name of everything you hold sacred. Please. What you are doing will make a problem between them. Mama, I saw... I, 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 I said, hold it right there. Hold it. Okay. No problem. Uh, no problem. Who knows if Melissa is saying the truth and I'm doubting her. It's been two days since Michael left his house, and whenever I call, he emphasizing on having a business meeting with Godric. <laughs> Michael, Michael, let these accusations not be true. Let it not be true, because I will kill that woman. <sighs> Past school hour and the boss has not dropped. Oh, baby. Good evening, my love. How are you and how was school today? School was fine and I'm fine. Oh, I see. I'm glad Fred brought me back. Oh, I, I see. Uh, I was passing by, so when I saw the boss, I have to stop and pick her up. Oh, thank you very much. So, baby, go inside and change it to something, okay? All right, darling. Oh, thank you very much, Alfred. I really appreciate it. Sis, what's the matter? You look worried. Do I? Yes. <laughs> no, nothing. Nothing is the matter. I'm fine. I think I'm, I'm just tired. I just need to rest. And about the money you requested for yesterday, I'll make some transfers later this evening. That will be the last money I'm sending to you. I'm not sending you anything else. Nothing. 
well. I'm not surprised, even if you don't give me the money again. Why do you have the money? I'll stand the money. Just imagine. Love is beautiful. Some call it madness, but I call it love. So this is what. This husband came on you. It's very rich, like stupidly rich. <laughs> you can <laughs> say that again. Hold him tight too. Don't let all these girls sighties snatch me away from you like you know go funny. Snatch my husband away from me. My dear, that's not possible now. I will kill that person. <laughs> Anyone that comes close to my husband, straight. <laughs> no, it's I, not possible. I you are talking as if you don't know the side chick I'm talking about. Like they will want him, they might, I'm not saying they would, they might want him by all means. <laughs> well, I understand what you're saying, just that I was never anybody's side chick, so nobody is going to be my husband's side chick, else the person wants trouble, because I will give the person any half, left, right, front, center, I will give the person trouble and heat. Ha. <laughs> I'd be better try you, because me, I can't afford to go back to the village, like, you know, as a poverty stinking boy again. Never. You're, you're not poor. Mm. Your sister got married to a rich man. So we are all rich now. Which one is you're not poor? Please don't don't try it again. Don't ever say you're poor. You are not poor. Oh, I'm not poor. And you know I don't wish to be poor. Like I can't wait to parade around like a like a big boy. Like a big boy to a big so boy, to you, a rich you know man. Now. <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> see, I'll convince my husband to do a lot of things for you. Whatever I say, he listens. I'm I've telling noticed you. that. You've noticed, right? Hey, hey, I'll tell you to do everything for you. I will see if this is why I love you. If possible, save you need to leave this country. There is no thing in this country. Seriously. I'm telling you now. <laughs> I'm going to do more when we see some other time, I promise. Just have this one for the transport, okay? Thank you so much. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Thank you so, so much. I'm, I'm very grateful. It's all right. Thank you. It's okay. I promise I'm going to take care of you. There is much of money to spend. This is nothing. Just, this one is just for the transport, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Give me a hug. All right, baby. I'll see you soon. Thank you. Okay. Mike, look me in the face and tell me I'm lying. Look me in the eyes and tell me I don't know what I'm talking about. Come on, babe. Why are you being so paranoid? I'm not cheating on you. Really? Yes. So where have you been for the past two days? Where did you go to? 
Definitely, I went for a business trip, and you know that. I even lodged in a hotel with Godric. <gasps> with Godric? Yes. The same Godric that denied knowing your whereabouts? Mike! Baby, probably Godric is true. Ah, God. I don't know what he's saying, baby. <sighs> Honey, you and I know I'm the last man that can ever cheat on you in this world. Huh? I can never cheat on you. Listen, let me tell you something. If I find out you are lying to me, if I ever find out that you're cheating on me, if I ever find out that you are lying to me, my girl, you will see the other side of me. Love is beautiful. Some call it madness, but I call it love. Baby, I'm taking this thing to another level. I'm not cheating on you. What it feels huh? Sweetie, sweetie, come on. It burns like fire in my heart. I'm on fire. <laughs> he denied it. Were you expecting him to accept it before? Lisa, I don't even know what to think anymore. I don't know what to believe. Everything seems like a dream to me. Hi. You don't have to, my dear. Men has come. What are you expecting? Eh? The man you made to be rich. You made him to be rich. So are you now expecting him to <laughs> stay just stay with you? Come on. No now. Don't stop now, Elisa. You're making it seem like I'm foolish for doing it. You are! You are more than foolish. Yes. Anyway, um, I will find out about the woman. And find and check where she lives. Please. I don't believe you. You know what? I will get to the root of this. I will find out the truth. Should you calm down, please? I just, I just, I just want you to calm down. It haven't gotten to this. Trust me. I don't trust you. You need to trust me. Okay? I will get to the root of this. That I promise. Please. Love is beautiful. Some call it madness, but I call it love. Bro. I called you out here because. Your wife reported you to me. Look, bro. Whatever it is you think you are told, whatever recent attitude you are displaying that is making her feel uncomfortable, please, I beg you in the name of God to drop it right here and right now. Please. <sighs> Don't you? You'll be someone that I've known me for a while now. Okay? And I'm a man that believes in so much love, affection, and you know. I love my wife. And I can never, ever, ever do anything to hurt her. You know, women, whenever they feel left out, they'll start feeling something is wrong somewhere. And that's what the problem is. 
exactly where the problem is. Whatever it is you're doing that is making her feel left out is where the problem is. Look, she is your wife. Whatever thing you want to do, whatever thing you want, whatever decision you want to make, you must come to an agreement with her. That is the only way peace will reign in your home. Look, man. We are men, I understand. But please, I am begging you. Don't do men thing in this case. Please. Please. It's okay. I'll help you. I'll do as you say. Good. I've always trusted you. I want chest. for the last time I'm sure. <laughs> I hope nothing is wrong because he's not picking my calls. Calling Alfred and he's not picking my calls. I know it from time that that guy is not real. He's a playboy. That's not true. He doesn't look like it. Come on, what are you even saying? Hey, I hope he has not slept with me and dumped me. Before uncle, what do you expect from a guy that clubs? If you stop seeing these things, this is not no true. They are not true, please. Afra doesn't look like that kind of person. Babe, you didn't lose out on any side. He slept with you and gave you money, so put yourself together. You don't understand. I'll, I'll call you back, please.
<laughs> really? Wow. And how did you locate me here? How did I look it here? Michael. <laughs> this is unbelievable. You even have domestic servants. And I'm sure this is your house. Hmm. And I should be your daughter. Wow. Olivia. I told you he was cheating on you. Babe, what's going on here? No, sweetie, it's okay. It's nothing to worry about. No, it's not okay. I need to know what's going on here. Baby, relax. It's nothing. It's nothing. Out there! Are you stupid? Are you, are you, are you, are you out of your mind? Get out! Stop it, girl! Stop! Who are you? Who the hell are you? I need to know! Why would you want to slap my husband, babe? I want to know what this drama is all about. After everything I did for you, after everything I did for you, that's so you bring me. Wow. Ungrateful oh, woman. Let's go inside. I told you. After everything she did for you, this is how you're going to pay her back. Michael, you are going inside. I don't want to see you just come back again. Have I made myself clear? I don't want to see you in this compound. Ungrateful follow. Nonsense. Michael. Michael, how could you hide such thing from me? So Michael, oh, you were married and you didn't let me know. Like you didn't tell me. Sweetie, so calm down. I don't love her. You're the one I love. Eh? Yes. Wait. You don't love her, and you got married to her. How? Baby, I married her because of money. Hmm? This woman has enough money to turn our lives around. You'll never know poverty again. Okay? Take it, you'll be. Are you sure about this? I'm sure. But at least you would have told me. That's just my problem. Sweetie, come on. I know what I'm doing. Hmm? Come here. Come here. I love you more than anything. I love you with all my heart. Me too. I love you. I'm the biggest part of me. Me too, baby. Look at you. You made a thousand, a thousand dollars now. Just look at you. That's the money you're talking about. Thank hmm? you, baby. It's fine. It's okay, no one. I should trust you, Rosa. Awesome. I love you so much. I love you, baby. My lady, I'm ready. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I mean, I'm fine now. Good, huh? Yeah. Money speaks, baby. Come on. Inquiry. What's it be this noise? Why are they here for this compound yesterday? And the robbers enter here. I'm the robbers. Okay. Hmm? Enter here. You know, get my, you don't see my rank. So yeah. I'm if person tells you I'm the wife, you enter here, you go agree. Then who can they shout? No, no, my girl first wife. Oh. What do you do? Your girl don't marry before. You see that man? Now read the silver. Ha! So you don't marry before? Ha! Me, I talk about you. I don't say that man is a footballer. But that's you, Ronaldo. He's a bit of a And then they enter. <laughs> they call him Sir Ronaldo. Man, they call him Carlo Guangbo. I they call him Mokocha. That man, they play bagala bagala bagala. If you papilo for here, now waiting the man carry. Just they play. Oh, you sabi this one too. Why you can't know? This is a gentleman. Gentleman for where? That man know they use I see woman. My wife they enter here. They go fat. Finish up. Finish up for you. Be careful with that your girl or your wife. Why the way your wife go they call you? I gave you my all, I gave you my heart, I gave you my sweat. Where is the love? Where is the love? Where is the love? You promised to be faithful.
faithful. You promised to be true to me. You promised me love. Where is the love? Welcome, ma. Um, how are you? I'm fine, ma. Is your guy inside? Yes, my guy is inside. Is Even madame there inside. Everybody there inside. House full, well, well. Your guy is in? Yes, ma. Let me get some. All right, ma. What you saw is what you reap. If you saw good, you reap good. If you saw evil, you reap evil. God is watching, He's watching you. He pays us back according to our deeds. Hey, nobody, wake up! Nobody, hey. What's happened? You're here sleeping. The house has been on fire. Madame and Doga first wife, don't call right fire. Are you serious? Ha. I hope they don't break themselves right there. If you see what a face has, eh? You remember them when they bring down all this building where they're for this compound. Ha! Oh ha. These people want to turn this place to battle zone, no? Is it battle zone? You see, very soon, eh? This house go so turn to wrestling ground. I beg, make a deal. Make a go check what they happen inside, eh? I beg, go there, go there, bring information, come they give me here. You know, say information is power. I dare here. I say gossip, why I be happy with you? I know me say it be gossip, at least if they bring news and they come give me an idea. I better go, Joe. Now, I'll give you information. Hey! Thank God, though, I didn't forget. One day, they will keep pressing for inside here. I go carry my bag from here, go to my village one time. Wham! Hey! See, Anna, don't come wake me up, Anna. Food I never eat, salary I no see. Every day, quarry, 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 quarry. Hear my prayer, O oh God. Give ear to my supplications. In your faithfulness, answer me. And in your righteousness, Lord, come to my aid. Judge me too rashly, Lord. Mama. What is it? You, you, you made my heart to jump, Ogeni. Mama, you need to see what my chaos son did to live here today. Ogeni, okay, did you go to the city? See for yourself. Okay. See for yourself. Oh my goodness! Michael did this to another person's child? Does he want to kill somebody? What is happening with this boy? What is the problem with this boy? Eh? This boy is... I don't know where he picked this attitude. He became a wife beater. Beating this girl up and down. Why? He was there. He saw his father. He saw the way we lived. His father never touched me any day. He never laid his hands on me. Where did he pick this up from? I did not bring him up this way. I did not. What is his problem? Mama, my girl pounded Olivia today. I was surprised when I saw this picture. This is okay. Mama, what do we do? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Mama, Olivia, what do my we baby, do? I'm sorry. I'm very, very sorry about this. I am so sorry. This is not happening. This is not happening, not while I am alive. This is not happening. Hey. Mama, what do we do? See, what, what we are going to do is that I am going to the city. I am going to the city right away. Let me look him in the face. Let me look into his eyes and tell him that what he is doing is wrong. Very, very wrong. Exactly, Mama. This is very, very wrong. Hey. It's very, very wrong. Mama, I can't imagine Michael treat Olivia this way after everything. Hey, hey. Michael, he met her at all. 
You did not do it well at all. Where is that? Where is that employee? Eh? Where is that senseless gatekeeper I employed? Inquiry! Inquiry! A very stupid boy. A very useless man that also have sense. Inquiry! Hey, 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 inquiry! Madam. Is your mother holding there? Inquiry! Madam. Slap yourself. Madam, what did I do? You should slap yourself. Are you deaf? Eh? Is that how to slap? I, eh, you heard the sound, right? That is how to give yourself a good slap for being so stupid and insensitive. Listen, let today be the last time you will ever open gates for anybody at all. Family member, so extended family. In fact, I don't care. Do not open this gate without notifying my husband and I. Did you hear me? Rubbish fool. Listen. If you try open gates for anybody in this compound without letting me know, or my husband, my dear, I will not just sack you, I will lock you up because that is what you deserve. Are you mad? Don't you know your job? You were supposed to call me. Madam, should I open gates? I, I will now give the instruction. I will say yes or no. You just open gates for any mad dog, you see. Now get out of my sight. Get out of my sight. Get out. Sue. You don't know you were supposed to call? Madam, should I open the gates? I'll say yes or no. Rubbish. Afred, I have been calling you, but you've not been picking my calls. Look, Chelsea, you don't expect me to pick your call always. I'm busy with work. <laughs> I don't understand. Afred, are you seeing another woman? It's obvious you're cheating on me. Look, Chelsea, I don't understand all this. We had a one night stand that I paid you. So why are you budging my life? Did I hear you say one night stand? So your intention was to sleep with me and leave me. Do you take me for a prostitute? Look, Jason, I paid you. I paid you. Which one is you paid me? What does that mean? Chelsea, just let me be, please. I have many things going in my head. I don't have time for this kind of discussion, please. I will have to see you some other time. I will take my hand now, please. Actually, what is going Jesse, on? Why are you behaving like this? What's going on? Alfred! To me, Mike, you lied to me. You told me you're not cheating on this girl. Let me not call her. You told me you're not cheating on your wife. So, what's this I'm hearing? What's this, Mike? What's happening? Why are you talking to me as if I'm a kid? Godric, I'm a full grown man and I can make my decisions. Mike, you can make your decision. Of course. Oh, really? Mike, when you came back from my bro, you had nothing. You had nothing, Mike. This lady picked you up, brushed you, and made you who you are today. Now you have the right to make a decision. Are you for real, Mike? Are you for real? Oh, come on, Godfrey. Come on. Why is everyone sounding this way? Why are you sounding as if we're divorced? She's still my wife. You're not divorced. She's your wife that you need to go on your knees and apologize to. You need to beg her, Mike. You broke her heart. You kept her in a condition she never imagined she's going to be. You did that to her. Mike, it is wrong. I will tell you to your face that it is wrong, Mike. Godric, if from the way I'm understanding it, you're trying to lure me to kneel down and apologize to her. Oh, really? I am not luring you to apologize to her. I am commanding you as a friend to go on your knees and apologize to your woman. Godric, she is I your... cannot do it. You cannot do it? Yes. Mike, 
You took another woman to a mansion you built out of her absence? Really, Mike? Oh, really, Mike? This is wickedness. This is wickedness and you need to go on your knees and apologize to her. I said I cannot do it. You can't? Yes. Oh, Stop really? treating me like a kid, man. I'm a grown man. Oh, really? Yes. Mike, you will regret every bit of your action. I am telling you this with every sense of you, man. You will regret it. You will not. Yes. Oh, you will not. Yes. You've made up your mind. You I will not. Will not. Huh. Mike, you will not. This is wicked. This is wickedness, Mike. This is wickedness. Yeah, yeah, you stop treating me like a kid. No, I'm not treating you like a kid. I'm treating you like someone that is senseless because you are not acting with your normal sense. You're not. Is you go? Hey! No. If I was told that Michael can treat Olivia this man, I won't, I, I would say no. Eh? This is really a stab. Somebody that, ha, ah, God, hi, hi. Mama, Ivy or whatever they call her, that girl is the cause of everything. She has been a problem to that marriage. Hmm. Ivy, VI, whatever it is. What, what, what is really happening? Are you sure this girl has not given Michael something to eat? Huh? Mama, something needs to be done. We need to caution Michael. We really need to caution him. Eh? I think he's under a spell. Mm. Honestly. Oh. But do you know, my, my daughter, there is still something I have to say. That Miri, Anagi, If Michael did not go close to that girl, how, how, how on earth? Can she come close to him to give him whatever? Eh? Mama, honestly, I'm disappointed at Michael. I'm sorry to use this word. Hmm. Michael is an ingrate. Michael, now, what was he doing? Eh? Did I bring him up this way? I did not. Hey. How can he forget so soon? How can Michael stab Olivia at the back like this? This girl that brought him up, washed him, and made him what he is. Look at the way he's treating her. Look at it. I come on over here. I am not there. Because I don't like, I don't like what I hate at all. I don't like what I hate. We need to do something very, very fast. Before things get out of hand. Tell her not to cross my kitchen again. Like she had the guts to go into my fridge. Took my chicken and fried it. Why? I want to know why. Please go on one now. Go on one now. Babe, I'm just respecting you. I'm just respecting you. If not, if not, I would have dealt with her. <laughs> I didn't mean you were not around now. She would have beaten me up. That's the way she does every day. That's what she does every day. Every day. Now, I know I'm peaceful. I'm a very peaceful person, baby. She has been the one looking for my trouble in this house. <laughs> Let her not touch my chicken again, no. Even my pepper or salt, let her not touch it again. <laughs> Olivia. Olivia, what are you doing? What are you doing? I hit him. Eh? What's him? Olivia, how many times have I warned you never to step your foot in my wife's kitchen? How many times have I warned you to stop cooking in that kitchen, Olivia? Michael, 
Are you referring to the kitchen you built with my money? What money? Is that the kitchen you're restricting me from? Which money are you talking about? Hey! Eh? Olivia, please, so. I love my wife so much. And I don't want anything that will make her to start nagging or start complaining or start ranting. I don't want it. Stay away from that kitchen. Unless you want me to kill you and answer more that case. Yes! Unless you want me to kill you and answer more that case. Stay away from that kitchen. Else! Till I see you in that kitchen again, you see what I will do to you. Just this is a great day. Happy day. Eat. Is there any pain was than this? Hey, baby. I Don't thought this was not. I gave you my heart. I gave you my No. Ikonne. Michael. My son, why are you treating Olivia like this? Why are you treating her like this? I can't see anything she has done for you to treat her this way. Have you forgotten so soon? Ennam, have you forgotten so soon? The way she, she, she pampered you and made sure you had everything you needed. Why are you, why are you like this now? Do you want me, me, your mother, to say that you are an ingrate? Do you want me to say that? Mama, I don't need to say it, but sometimes you need to, you know, listen to my own part of the story. Mm -hmm. So what is your own part of the story? Uh, she's not behaving well, Mama. Yeah, she's not. So when did you start noticing this behavior of us? Huh? Michael, honestly, I'm disappointed at you. You know I can never support this evil. Remember that Olivia made you. Whatever you are today, she made you. Look at this beautiful house. Look at her businesses. The cars. Why are you treating her this way? Michael, remember what you promised me, that you can never disappoint her. Then what is happening now? Michael, I'm your elder sister. I will never, ever mislead you. How you are treating Olivia is too bad. He's my brother. Please. Olivia is a nice girl. She's well trained. But I keep asking myself this question. Why would she be going around, you know, discussing things that has to do with my matrimonial home outside? It's not right. So where where has she been going around? Where? Mama, there shouldn't be a thought party. Because she came and told Michael, us. Michael, if Olivia did not tell us, mm -hmm. who else will she tell? Eh? Or do you want her mm -hmm. to go to her people and tell them? It will be more problem for us. No. Is it this one that is behaving well? She doesn't have any kind of respect. Doesn't respect anybody. I'm among Talks anyhow. You see the one that you want to, the one that you now love. And um, how can you love somebody like that? It's okay, Mama. I'll think about it. And remember, you married her without our consent. We never knew you were going to marry her. Of course, we wouldn't have accepted that. Without our consent, who even does that? Who does that? You went and married on your own, without your family. Ah, Nambiko. You have to do a, a U turn. U turn. Where is he? Come out, where is he? Where is he? Come out, my girl. Please calm down. What is it? Where is he? I want to see him. I, I called you here to tell you. I, I only called you here to tell you what's going on in your household. I'm not going to come and constitute. Olivia, you will not tell me that. I need to see Michael and see. Let him tell me why he did this to you. Why did he beat you up? He's not why? Around. He's not around. Are you, are you stupid? Are you mad? Like you lack home training? You were not trained? Actually, you came into someone's compound and you're just ranting, shouting like an idiot. Ah! Are you okay?
Okiato! This is the intruder that crumbled this marriage, right? Oh, shut up! Do not call me an intruder again! Wait, listen! Michael never told me he was married! And I am legally married to him as well! So are you stupid? Why would you call me an intruder? In my own house! Hey! No, no, no! I will not do that. Alfred, you need to save your sister. Eh? Save her, she's your blood. Melissa, when I warned her not to sponsor that guy, she, she, she never listened to me. She went and opened a business for that guy. And now she wants me to come and defend her. I will not try that. Alfred, stop saying this, please. Stop it. Olivia is your blood, your only sister. Why, why, why are you doing this? Go and save her. Do you want her to die? Melissa, she's an adult and she can defend herself. She is a rich woman and nobody should disturb me on this issue again. Please. Period. Check it now. That's care. Afraid to come. Please, Melissa, I don't want to be rude to you. Please. Don't disturb me on this issue again. If you want to call me on another issue, I will listen to you. But Afraid. as far as this particular issue is concerned, please let nobody disturb me on this issue again. Please. Abel, why are you crying? <laughs> and they asked you to leave? Yes. It's okay. Don't worry. Stop crying. Eh? Hmm? I will give you my phone to watch with you later. Hmm? Meanwhile, I will call your mommy and inform her right away. Okay? It's okay. Come, let's go in. Eh? Don't mind them. Why did you ask my daughter to leave? Is this not a father's house? Zara also has a right in this house. Oh, yes. Listen, I would tolerate anything from you, not you intimidating my daughter in her father's house. She has no right here. And who told you? You know she doesn't belong here. Don't you have a house, Olivia? Take your daughter to your own house. Who told you she doesn't belong here? And you... Oscar, it's high time you stop coming to this house. Because it is obvious you're creating more havoc. Hello? Like... Woman, you dare not speak to me in such disgusting manner, else make you a joker. What will you do if I do? No, tell me! Hey. What will you do? <laughs> tell this lady to leave my shirt. What will you do? Olivia, oh, leave my brother. Olivia, oh, leave my brother alone. What will you do? Leave my brother alone. What will you do? I will tell Oscar to beat you. What will you do? I will do? tell Oscar to handle you. What will you do? Troublemakers, you see, like mother, like daughter. Imagine, she knows you can't even treat your child very well. You didn't treat your child. Just imagine. No, no, just, just look at, just look at what you allowed this girl to say in presence of her elders. They are troublemakers. I am your mate now. I'm a troublemaker. Rubbish. Don't go and train your daughter well. She has a right to it. <laughs> you see fire. Maya. Maya, why did you call Olivia to tell her to come home because I asked Mabel to leave the sitting room? I, I didn't call her for ma. Do you think I'm a joke? Huh? What do you take me for? Answer me! I didn't call her for ma. I'm saying the truth. Trust me. Oh! Trust you? I will never trust you! No way! Because you practically turned against me the very day she stepped into this compound. And you want me to trust you? I won't trust you! Maybe you don't value your job. Now, I want you to mind your business in this house. Else, I will fire you! Rubbish! What do you take me for? A fool or something? No, ma. Now listen, look at me. I want you to look at me 
look into my eyes. Listen attentively. If you don't behave yourself in this house, I will personally throw your things out, then discharge you, stupid girl. Get out! Rubbish! I gave you my all, I gave you my heart, I gave you my sweat, where is the love, where is the love, where Hey, 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 what are you trying to do? Listen, you are not going anywhere with that car. Oh yes, because I am trying to do Oh, you think I'm joking? Ivy, it is obvious you're set for trouble this evening. Today, I am ready for you. Oh, Olivia, bring it on! Bring it on! Listen, my friend, this is my husband's car and you're not going anywhere! Never! Get it back! Get it back! Get it back! See, I'm Olivia! 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 I'll deal with you! Olivia, I can't resist this kid! Olivia, I resist this kid! Olivia, I resist this kid! Rubbish! You wanna go out? In this car, you are you okay? Well, I changed my mind. I am not going anywhere, okay? Oh yes, I changed my mind, Olivia! Do your worst! You can use Kate, you my box, anything! I warned you about that man. What did you do? You insulted me, ignored me, and walked away. I'm sorry. Alfred, I'm sorry. I was carried away. I, I was so in love with him. I, I didn't know it was going to be this way. I didn't know he was going to turn out to be this who he is today. I, I thought he liked and, and appreciated everything I did for him. I never knew he was an ungrateful fellow. I just want you to come to the house. Come to the house and talk some senses into his head. At least let him know I have a brother, an elder brother that can stand and fight for me. Please, Alfred. Sis, what you're asking is very difficult. I cannot do that. I'm sorry. Alfred. Alfred, Alfred, please. I'm your only sister. I'm your sister. Oh, Alfred. 
Alfred now. Alfred, I'm your sister. Alfred, I'm your... <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? I'm serious, my darling brother. <laughs> like, like, your husband dealt with her. Seriously. <laughs> you know, that sounds all right. Mm -hmm. Since she has decided not to live here mm -hmm. in peace, oh. then she will die. Of course. She, she has to. She will. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, she will. So, Oscar, this is what we hear. Sitting here with this your foolish sister discussing on how to treat and maltreat Olivia, right? Watch your tongue, woman. If you dare insult me, I will forget whatever you are to my brother and get you arrested. And I mean it. Oh, Madam Lillian, why are you here? Like, what exactly are you doing? Anyway, I know you don't have respect. I'm here to see you, Ivy. Now, listen to me. There is no way we, the AZH's family, will accept you. Unless you are going to live the rest of your life here in the city. And I've reported you to the elders. They are waiting for you. So if you know what is good for you, pack all your things and live in peace to avoid disaster. Have a nice day. Have a bad day. Lillian, have a bad day. I will have a nice day for you. you have the worst day today. <coughs> Imagine you. She Imagine she's Lillian. She's up to nothing. Threatening me in my husband's house. Chill, relax. You have reported she, me. She's just in my country. To the air that. Yes, I will have don't to worry, be in the city forever. Since no one is supporting me. This house for peace to reign. Ah, ah, Madam, please don't leave. Yeah? I'm sorry, I have to. My life is at risk here. I, I, I'm sorry, I have to leave. Madam, if you leave this house, Nkori and I are dead. Madam, Ivy will use that against us, please. Nothing will happen to you. You still have my phone number, right? Call me if you need anything. Uh, just hold. Just take it. Here. Give airtime and call. Okay? Just take care of this.
Where is the love? Where is the love? You promise to be faithful. You promise to be true to me. You promise me love. Where is the love? Like I mean Ooh. massive one. <laughs> like finally she has left. Hey, I'm so happy. Uh -uh. <sighs> Sis, like I'm so happy as well. Seriously, finally she left. Like she left. The heat was much. The fire was all over. <laughs> she had to go. Whoa, at least she left for peace. For peace. Uh, there will be no more fighting and quarreling in I'm this house. I'm telling you, seriously, the heat was too much on her. The fire was all over her. She said, no, I cannot take this anymore. I want to go back to my house. She ran away. <laughs> this is good news, bro. <laughs> it calls for a celebration. I'm you know? telling you, it calls for celebration. So I'm just scared this drink. Uh -huh. <laughs> I cannot sleep and wake up in peace. Mm -hmm. No one will shout at my ear every time. <sighs> at least we want the house. The... Uh -uh. How is it possible that another woman from nowhere would want to come and take my place in my husband's house? That is not possible. Like, it won't happen at all. I trust you. See, I trust you. No, I trust Oscar, you. Oscar, That's last. I you have want to the thank you, of course. But Oscar, thank you so much. Thanks yes. for being by my side. You're such a darling brother. Oh. Thanks for being by my yeah, side. Oscar! Again, a peaceful woman again. Wow. Every day. Michael, that's right. Michael, go and bring back Olivia. Yes, bring her back and send this bad dog away. You want me to send away the woman that I love? The woman I call my wife. Love. Huh? <laughs> you are the one that wronged Olivia. And if you don't bring her back, you are going to regret it. Mama, there is nothing you say now that I'll listen, I'll listen to. I've made my decision and that is fine now. Oh, really? Mm. <sighs> okay. But well, God will bear me witness that I have spoken to you in the way a mother should speak to a son, a derailing son. I have spoken to you in that manner. Because I know Definitely, the repercussion must come. And when it does come, I will not be there. Mama, you will no, never call me. There will be no repercussion. Hey, leave me alone. Mama, there will be no repercussion. Huh? I love her. Just believe me. I, I just see you have your heart at the back of your body. At the back. You are so heartless. You are so heartless. What you saw, you read. I S Eve. I F Eve. I F Eve. I F Eve. How come there's no food from you on, on the dining table? What happened? Yes, there's no food in this house. What do you mean there's no food in this house? Does it mean that Maya didn't cook? Of course she didn't. She did not. Why? Oga, can't you just let me be in this house? I need peace. You're stressing me. You disturb me too much in this house and I don't like it. Like, I am not comfortable with it. Please just let me be. There is no food that you're here questioning me. Ah! Am I supposed to answer all these questions? Am I the one you're raising your voice at? Yes. Yes, 
What if I raise my voice at you? What if I raise my voice at you? Michael, what will you do? Oh, you think I'm Olivia? That you hit like a punching bag. I am not Olivia. Michael, let me remind you. I now have a song. Oh, yes. And whatever I say in this house stands. Let me be, please. Leave me alone. If it was easy, the person you had before me would have given you a male child. But she didn't now. <laughs> she couldn't. So let me be, oh, please. Ah, uh -uh. what is it? Please, and my darling, if you're hungry, mommy will go to an e tree, get you something to eat, okay? Alright? Uh -huh. <laughs> oh. So, Junior, if you're thirsty, you let mommy know, yeah? So, Maya will get you what I'll juice, okay? So eat your biscuits. Baby. Mm -hmm. So did you see my ATM card? You're looking for your ATM card? Yes. I, I can't see it anywhere in the house. Uh -huh. Even the back doors, they beat me. I was thinking, are you sure these scammers have not stolen my ATM card? Scammers? Mm -hmm. I'm with your ATM. When did you start taking my ATM card without my permission? I don't understand. Am I supposed to answer that question? Of course. Well, I went shopping this morning for Junior and Zara. So I needed some money. Then <laughs> I had to go with your ATM. Baby, I just, I just gave you some money last week. So what happened to And you think that's enough? You think that's enough? The money you gave to me was not enough. Oh, yes. Listen, please. Next time, when I demand for any amount of money, you give me the exact amount I demanded. Oh, yes. I'm not trying to play with me. If you had given me enough money, I won't touch your ATM. Please take this thing. Take it. Okay, collect your card now. Karma is real. Karma is real. Karma is real. Karma is real. What you saw. What you saw, you Karma is real. Karma is real. It's time to pay. Gucci, can you do help? Hmm? I mean, I, I, I called you out here because I, I need to talk to you. I need someone to talk to. And I don't have any other opportunity to talk to you if not you. I need your help. Ivy is the worst woman any man can live with under the same roof. She has turned me into a vegetable. Ivy shouts at me. She harasses me. She stabs me. She 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 have turned me to, to a, a a slave. Wow. Eh? Okay, look at today now. She she withdrew a huge amount of money from my bank account without even letting me know. Eh? And when I when I complain, she will shout at me. As if I don't have any right to tell her, why will you take money from my bank account? Without my consent. Oh, my brother. Congratulations. Oh yes, Ivy does everything as in I would say congratulations because you deserve everything as much you deserve worse. You deserve every bit of what is happening to you. You should enjoy it. Could you please? Oh, yes. yes. Huh? You're my friend though. I, I I I need you. We can fix this. You can help me. We, I need an advice from you. Just tell me what to do. <laughs> we can do this now. Oh, yes, we can huh? do this. I need to do I mean, I mean, let's just find it. Even if you send me out of the house, we can do it. Hold on, Mike. Hold on. Huh? Hold on a second. You need advice from me. Yes. Are you serious now? Mike, I called you out. I pleaded with you to retrace your steps. What did you do, Mike? You threw it back to my face. Now you're sitting here asking me to come up with advice or to talk to you on what? Discuss what with you? I don't have any advice to give to you. It is your cross. Please carry it. Please sort yourself out, Biko. Hi. <laughs> what, what, what is wrong with you? Why will you be lying down on my matrimonial bed? What does it look like I was doing there? Sleeping, of course. I was sleeping. I have 12 rooms in this house and there's no other place to lie there if not in my matrimonial bed. 
don't try it next time. Bro, I was sleeping there, period. You don't have... Are you high? Are you, are you stupid? Like I'm, I'm talking to you, you're walking out of me. That, don't you know it's disrespectful? Don't slide down on my matrimonial bed again. Have I met... Oh, what was that supposed to be? You want to fight me? If I fight you, and then... So you want to fight me? Oh, bring it on. Bring it on, let me see what you got. Bring it on. If you see the way Madame and her brother beat Oga, if you see it, are you serious? <laughs> see, since Madame gave birth to that her son, eh, she just the behavior anyhow. Eh? Like she, like, like, like she be the husband, not be even wife. Ah, hmm. I don't notice Samu. I notice Sam, but Oga deserve this thing. Yes, you see this way they happen to Oga now. Now waiting they call come pay back. Maya, Maya, uh, Madam. See, I don't go here. Eh? Eh, make Madam go here before she come here. I come here shout. Hey, go and go. I don't retire for this place. I go find work. Where I go the chop money belly full, get peace of mind. Here, they rack and they rack every day. Buckle, 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 buckle. I never see man to marry two wife no good. I swear. Sister Lilia, please, I need your help. I want you to help me chase Ivy out of this house. I don't want her anymore, please. I want Olivia back to the house. Michael, you need my help now. When I asked you to stop maltreating Olivia, did you pay attention to me? Sister, I regret my actions. I just need Olivia back, please. You're the only one that can help me, please. Hey, yeah. You need my help. I thought Ivy is the best woman for you. Please be with her. And don't disturb me, please. Sister, please now. I'm still your only brother. Eh? I know I've wronged you guys, but I, I still need you. I can't do this alone, please. Huh? Mm -hmm. Michael, is this the reason you asked to see me? Yes, yes, please. Please, I, I need you. You're my sister. I, can, I can't do this without you, please. Just come and help me, please. Michael, please, please, please. Carry your cross and solve your problem. Don't disturb me again. What you saw is what you read. If it's so good, you reap good. If you so evil, you evil. God is watching, He's watching. He pays us God according to our deeds. So finally, your God don't surrender. Because your mother don't come to second time. <laughs> Ajay, if person tell me say my go to humble like this, I don't go believe him. <laughs> I talk him. I don't say that woman go show him pepe. I take no. You be prophet. <laughs> See this one. Forget this me from where we are so. You know say by now I suppose don't get church. If you get church, you go be taught of Satan. <laughs> this one I insult I've been awaiting. <laughs> Every time you go, they talk nonsense, they talk blah blah blah. No worry, one day I go join hand like this with your madam. You shall have this compound. You fit. <laughs> Melissa, thank God I met you here. Michael, what do you want? Melissa, I know I've been a jackass. I've been I've been a very stupid man and very foolish, but please, find a place in your heart to forgive me. Uh, take me but take me to Olivia. I want to see Olivia, please. Which Olivia are you talking about? Come on. You know the Olivia I'm talking about. Olivia, my wife. <laughs> Michael, the Olivia you maltreated and chose that intruder over her. Is it the Olivia you're talking about? Melissa, please. I beg in the name of God, please. At least let me just see her with my two eyes and apologize. Where for your information? 
The Oliver you're talking about have traveled. She's in abroad now. She left this company under my care. Okay, um, just give me her phone number. Uh, please let me call her on phone. Okay? Which phone number? Excuse me, please. Melissa. Melissa. What you saw, you read. What you saw, you read. Come with me. It's time to pay back what you've done before. Karma is real. Karma is real. Oh, it's real. What you saw, you read. Karma is Inside the motor, carry them come out. Then I said, They won't go to the five, go chop up or be in a water. Then I said, Hey! What did you say? You say what? So, Madam, carry your children, carry back, come out. Then I say, In the world, hey! 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 Corey, how could you let her go? You fool! You're a fool! Hey! Yes, Maya, go. Mama, please, just follow me to my girl's house. And he needs us now. Mama, please, now follow me to my girl's house now. Mikey needs us now. Do you want to eat? I'm not eating, I'm not hungry. Mama, please now. What is your problem? Hmm? What is it? Mama, please follow me to Michael's house. Why are you disturbing me? You don't want, want me to eat. Eh? Mama, please follow me to Michael's house. Eh? He needs us now. Eh, Michael needs you now. Yes, Mama. Mm. Oh, he needs us now. Mm. When I told Michael, to send that that evil girl away, Ivy or whatever her name is. He said he would never do it. Instead, he kept maltreating a girl that loved him with all her heart. He kept maltreating her. Now she is gone. You want me to go and do what? Huh? To go and console? And you call me to go? Mama, my case is only son. So if he's an only son, what? If he's an only son, so bloody what? Did I bring him up like this? Did I bring him up to be a foolish man? Did I bring him up to be stupid? Mama, please, no, you need to forgive Michael. Eh? He has realized his mistakes now. Eh? Forgive me. Forgive me. You better to go Lily and also. Mama, I am not going anywhere with you. Read my lips. I am not going anywhere with you. I have more important things to do for crying out loud than Sheba, Tucharopa, Gawa, Ile, somebody that is a very stupid man. Oh, I'm not going. 
He is your brother. You can go. Go to him. Whatever it is, sort it out with him. I'm not going to. Mama, what if you hear that something has happened to Michael? Tell me what will you do. Something like what? <laughs> something bad. <laughs> Nothing will happen to him. Nothing will happen to Michael. Michael will leave. Hmm? He will leave to reap the fruit of his foolishness. And when he get me, he will leave. He will leave. Mama, please now. Mama, stop eating now, eh? I should stop, stop eating. eating now. Eh? Michael is in pain and you are here eating. Did he tell you he's in pain? Yes, Mama. Then go to him. Mama, he's your brother. Please. Go to him and sort it out with him. He will leave and, and know that he has done, done a lot of bad to himself. Mike. Michael. You really need to stop drinking, okay? You're hurting yourself. I can't. Just, just let me drink myself to death. No. Just allow no, stop, me. Stop, let stop, me just. Stop. This is Mike, one stop. bottle. No. Please. No. It's okay. You had enough. Don't right? drink. I've, I've lost everything. Olivia is gone. Ivy is gone. Let me just die. No. We're not going to die. Okay. What we need to do is to find a way to fix things. That's the only way out. Drinking is not going to solve any problem. Even if you get high today, next morning you're back to your problem. So drinking doesn't solve any problem. So the best thing to do is to find a way to figure things out. That's the way out. Where do I go from there? How? 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 Huh? Just... Just... I won't let you. It's, it's okay. You calm down. Hmm? We'll sort it out. We'll find a way to figure things out. Ah! Oh. It's okay, bro. It's okay. What you saw is what you read. If it's so good, you reap good. If it's so evil, you reap evil. It's okay, Michael. It's okay, stop crying. Be a man. At least this one has taught you a lesson. Don't worry, if your children grow up tomorrow, they'll come back to you. So stop crying. Be a man. Be a man. Please. Remember, we all warned you. Mama warned you. If Mama refused to come when she heard the news, please, my brother. I'm here because I'm your sister. I love you so much. I can't abandon you this time. Stop crying. Be a man, my brother. Eh? Thank you. Are you not know, the Mike I used to know before? It's okay. Hmm? It's okay. That's okay. It's okay. Love is beautiful. Some call it madness, but I call it love. So this is what it feels like It burns like fire in my heart I'm on fire